Ellipper has had their sights set on Pine Island in Beaufort County for months, but the Gullah Geechee people and environmental advocates are fighting back for the land they say they deserve. Melissa Rademacher explains the most recent decisions in the lawsuit. Pine Island and St. Helena Island aren't your average barrier islands. They are a part of the Gullah Geechee Cultural Protection Overlay Zone. That zone bans particular developments like golf courses and gated communities to protect those islands' culture. For the past year, one developer has continued to try for the right to put a golf course and community on Pine Island. The county zoning board and council denied the request because of the cultural zone. Now the developer is suing in protest of the cultural zone. But most recently, a judge granted intervention in the lawsuit to the Gullah Geechee Nation, landowners and environmentalist groups. This gives the community a strong voice of their own in the legal battle. Community, the community voice matters and it, you know, when the community has spoken, it's it's important and incumbent upon um, decision makers and potential developers alike to listen. And we have zoning rules for a reason. Um, there is a very highly specific community driven zoning overlay on St. Helena for a reason, and that's because it's the largest concentration of living Gullah Geechee culture. Um, in Beaufort County. The Coastal Conservation League and the landowners they are working with are confident that the special zone protects the islands and they believe that the law is on their side going forward. In the newsroom, Melissa Rademacher, Live 5 News.